Hey, what's up YouTube? It is the 31st of January 2023 and I've got two batteries connected in parallel. Uh, so they're just joined together basically. See the two positives there are joined together, the two negatives are joined together. These cables are going to my diesel heater. Now I've got this controller set up again just to show you that it can be a good option if you're not running a high powered turbine. So I'm just going to ditch the lights a second. You'll notice the little green light on the right of the screen means that it's charging and hopefully the red light will come on which means the system's putting the brake on. I must say it's not very windy, I'd say 12 to 13 miles an hour. Right, while we're getting some electricity I'm going to put this on. And we'll see if that all is the equation at all, how much power it's going to make. So if you hear that clicking noise in the background, you know it's still running. What we're going to try and achieve is we're going to try and get the brake light to come on while we're running the diesel heater. The diesel heater will have a 40 watt drain constantly. The batteries want to settle at about 12.7, so the turbine's got to work hard just to get over 13.7. When it gets to 14, the brake will come on. So that's what I'm hoping will happen. Right, so that's finished the glow plug now. And it'll get up to 40 watts usage and it'll stay there. I don't think the brake's going to come on, unfortunately, but we'll stick with it until the camera runs out of juice. Right, I'm going to power this down. One last try to get that little unload light to come on. Oh, I've just put it on 24 volts. This might, this could be promising. Hey, finally. Finally the brake came on. Woo! Hey, and again. Sweet, I'll leave that recording for a minute while I go have a cup of tea, but that's certainly working a lot better and connected to two batteries in series.